hello friends welcome back in this video we will see simple java programs or first java programs print hello world. so let's start it before we start to write a program you must install java and eclipse and create a project if you not install java and eclipse then first upon all watch my video link is in description then you can watch this video now we can start to write a program so first of all go to the package right click new class and give class name as hello words but make sure that the first letter of class name should be capital and remaining letter should be small so as this way we have created a simple class hello world next step is to create a main method in java main method is the entry point of any java program its syntax is always public static void main string args you can only change the name of string array argument for example you can change args to my string args in main method syntax public is the access modifier it has to be public so that java runtime can execute this method remember that if you make any method non-public then it is not allowed to execute suppose uh, i make the uh, access modifier as non-public then in output we will get the error like main method not found in class please define the main method as public static void main string args our main method should be static because when java runtime start there is no object of the class present so that's why the main method has to be static so that jvm can load the class into memory and call the main method if the main method won't be static jvm would not be able to call it because there is no object of the class is present if we make it uh, uh, non-static or we remove the static from java main method then at the output side we will get the error like main method is not static in class please define the main methods so as this way uh, we get the error at the output side here the void keyword specifies that method should not have a return value in java each method provide return type but in java main method doesn't return anything that's why its return type is void here main is the name of java main method it is fixed and when we start java program it looks for the main method in main method syntax string args meaning is main method accepts a single argument of type string array this is also called as java command line arguments now we can write print statement in main methods body that is system dot out dot println into bracket into double quote hello world now we can save and run the program it prints the text hello hello world at the output console so as this way we can write a basic program and execute in eclipse and see the output at output console 